we are heading down these uh, long, winding, dark roads to the the manor. Hey, look, it's Bambi. Lavo is just staring at me. Well, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the vlog. It is a brand new day. It is so sunny and beautiful outside. Uh, this is really exciting because we got so much stuff planned for like the next week, week and a half. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I'm glad I'll be able to bring you guys along. Today I'm not too busy. I'm pretty much just kind of editing, getting myself caught up on a lot of the main channel videos. I just finished editing and uploading a new vlog for you guys, so hope you guys like that one. We were actually at a diner where uh, Brent obviously knows the owners and stuff, and uh, we ended up prank calling them, which was absolutely hilarious. They got a really good kick out of it and thought it was really funny too. Um, but yeah, again, shout out to TJ's Diner. Great food and uh, glad they enjoyed the, the little bit of fun we had there too with the prank. But uh, yeah, I am at the original hero again uh, this is like my go-to place for lunch sometimes dinner uh, because of the area that I'm in where my Airbnb is so I'm gonna grab some lunch I'm trying to stay light um, so I'm probably just gonna grab a Greek salad and get my day started so this is gonna be my lunch for the day oh they even gave me some pita a little Greek dressing on top you know, that's what we need. Greek dressing is life. And uh, one thing you should know about me is things fall out of my mouth when I try to eat them. <laughs> but I also love kalabata olives, so. so good. And feta. And salad. Really good. Okay guys, so I'm actually heading over to Dave and Buster's. Uh, reason why is because Brent and Matt are both there right now. Uh, Brent is actually doing a live stream and neither of them know I'm even going to show up. So uh, hopefully they don't leave before I get there because that would suck. Uh, where do I got to go? 887 South. Oh man, the roads here are so confusing. I gotta put you guys down so I gotta concentrate. All right, we've made it to Dave and Buster's. I'm not gonna bring this camera in just because I really don't feel like it. Probably gonna play a few games anyways. Uh, yeah. Your destination is on the left. Oh yeah, they're still here because their cars are here. Like I said, they have no idea what I'm, what, uh, they have no idea that I'm coming, so this is gonna be really funny. All right, I'll see you guys inside. All right guys, so I have located them. Um, I'm walking towards them. I just checked the stream, so I pretty much know which area they should be in. It's gonna be really funny. Howdy! We have found bread. <laughs> I'm done. Hey guys, continuing on with the vlog, it is now the next day, the afternoon. I am actually gonna go get a uh, brunch at Eaton Park. So this Eaton Park is a little bit special and you guys will see why in a little bit. Um, but yeah, I am so hungry. Definitely looking forward to a, a good meal. All right guys, I've uh, put my breakfast order in. Um, Really, really in dire need of some coffee. Hopefully it comes soon. Because so I really need that, that caffeine this morning. So tired, so sleepy today. I don't know why. This place, honestly, it sucks. Um, and this is the reason why. Worst server ever. Can't even get coffee, right? <laughs> yeah, have you guys ever seen Brent's hair like this? Slick. So, so fancy. It's like a, like a grease ball. I know. <laughs> I know. So, busy day so far? I'm busy. Hello, so I, explain how to How long us. were you waiting? Because I asked, I had no tables for a second. I said to the servers, am I getting one to eat anything? And this one lady said, yeah, I'll get me three milkshakes. <laughs> and then I come out and then I see you and then I had another table. I think we're good. Yeah. I'm usually, I'm pretty, I'm fast. Yeah. Like I'm the, really. The life of a waiter. I mean, so, I love it. Like the energy. Yeah, it's quick. You got, I've got these new shirts. I don't like oh, them. Oh yeah, I can see your nipples. Everybody, this is Brent's nipple. Oh as God. far as it goes. <laughs> Don't that. Fired. Okay, my breakfast has arrived, and it's uh, a lot bigger than I expected. This is actually pretty funny. <laughs> Brent put a smile on you. He says they're supposed to, but a lot of police, a lot of them don't do it for some reason. But damn, this looks real good. Uh -oh. Continuing on with the vlog, um, 
We're headed to Hillview Manor now, the uh, most haunted nursing home in America. Brent is currently dead in the uh, passenger side seat because, well, I killed him. Brent? <laughs> yeah, so this time, unfortunately, we don't have Matt, so there's nobody to uh, stand there and protect Brent other than myself. So, yeah. Oh, wow, there's a lot of cars here. Yeah, there's a lot of people here tonight. Okay, a little more relieving. Yeah. There's more people than there were last time. Well, I mean, last time was also, like, Middle November, winter. December. It was really cold. Oh, man, I remember that. We were all wearing jackets and shit in here. It's 3 a.m. <laughs> We're coming to buy hot dogs and SpongeBob popsicles. Oh my god! So how was Hillview this time? Bad. Yeah. It was kind of creepy. It was creepy. Parts. It was a little more active this time. I felt like, like different active. Mm. That was weird. We got like this this gust. I don't even know how to describe it, but it felt like somebody ran through us. I don't know, very interesting. Yeah, oh yeah, hey. It was a little time. Yeah, exactly. So we're gonna go get some hot dogs and popsicles now and uh, we'll see you in a little bit. It is now 3.30 in the morning and we are getting food that will destroy our buttholes later on. They didn't have popsicles. Yeah, I know, they didn't have popsicles. What the hell, Sheets? I'm complaining. You should complain to head office, bro. That's, that's uncalled for. So no SpongeBob popsicles for you. We're gonna do a uh, 3 a.m. challenge. Anyway, got some coffee, some chicken sliders, uh, matzo sticks, and Italian sausage. What'd you get? That's so much food. I, just I know. I don't know why I got all that. Half a meatball hoagie, half a turkey. <laughs> <laughs> and those are the got chicken yeah. sliders, I got churros, I got Italian sausage, I got a hot dog. I also got an eight ounce steak too. And a Rice Krispie. That's and a Rice Krispie. <laughs> what is this? What the hell did I order? <laughs> Like shit. I know it looks like literal garbage. The cheese on top. Oh god, I paid extra for cheese. No, you did. I you, I did. It was an option. It was like forty nine cents. Let's see how it tastes though. I gotta put it in. <laughs> no, <I'm joking. laughs> I mean, whatever, man. Three thirty in the morning. Like, what else are you gonna get? I want a family breakfast at eight. Are you really? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, you're f <laughs> So I also ordered uh, Italian sausage. I took a couple of bites out of it. Honestly, it's probably the worst sausage I've ever had. Continues to eat it. Is there mayo on it? I asked for mayo. On sausage? Hell yeah. Mayo goes on everything. <laughs> Would you put mayo on your pasta? There you go. Yeah, so good. I'm getting used to the shitty taste now. <laughs> oh man, what a long day. It is literally almost 5 o'clock in the morning. Um, I'm almost back at the Airbnb. I'm about 9 minutes away. Um, yeah. Hillview Manor is like really far from Pittsburgh. Well, not really far, but like maybe about an hour away, an hour and ten minutes from Brent's house. So it has been a lot of driving, um, but yeah, it was definitely a, a really cool experience doing it again. This time was uh, quite different from the last time I had filmed Hillview Manor. Just caught a lot of different stuff. Not too far away from the Airbnb now. It is literally five minutes to five. Um, yeah, I will be there soon and then I can go to bed. So looking forward to it. Hey, look, it's Bambi. Oh, look at that. That's so beautiful. Oh, I don't want to scare you. 
Hi. Look at it. Oh, that's so awesome. Lavo is just staring at me. Hi. <laughs> You don't have to be afraid. Okay, bye. <laughs> Whoa. Oh my god, there's another one. Look at that. Oh man. Hi, beautiful. Wow. I love deer. They're so majestic. <laughs> it's crazy over here how they literally just go through people's lawns and stuff. I almost didn't even see the first one. Thank god I noticed it at the last second. There he goes. Let's hope there's not another one uh, hiding back there somewhere. No, I think we're good. Yeah, back where I'm from in Canada, definitely not as common to see deer, especially not uh, roaming through neighborhoods like that. So that's pretty awesome to see. Um, I really enjoyed that. Good morning, or good afternoon rather. Um, so I definitely slept in. We were up really, really late. Got back, like I said, at like five o'clock in the morning. And I did a whole bunch of stuff, had to do my laundry, because um, we have a busy week coming up. There's going to be a lot of stuff going on, which I'm really excited about. As you can tell, I'm quite tired, um, even in my voice, you could probably hear it. But um, I am really, really hungry at the same time. I'm going to try this place called Panera Bread. Everybody keeps telling me it's pretty good, it's very popular over here. I, believe it or not, have never tried it. This is going to be the first time. And uh, hopefully it's good, but let's head on inside and uh, see what they have to offer. All right, so I ordered some uh, turkey, avocado, something or other. <laughs> I don't even really remember what the f I ordered. Um, but it comes with a little baguette. Pretty cool. This place is huge. I wasn't really uh, expecting this. It literally goes all the way down. Order down there. You pick up over here at the rapid pickup or whatever they call it. But yeah, let's dig in because I am far room. All right guys, so uh, finished my Panera. A little bit of a uh, review. I'm kind of disappointed. I mean, unfortunately it was a little bit just bland. There wasn't like it was healthy, but it was just bland. There was almost no flavor to the actual sandwich. I mean, what more could you expect from turkey and avocado? I thought there was gonna be like bacon on it. I didn't notice any bacon in the sandwich. Whatever, who cares? Um, I am going to head over to Starbucks now because I really, really need some espresso. Had coffee earlier, but I need my espresso fix. And we are back at the Original Hero, the go-to place here in Castle Shannon. I swear I've been eating at this place like almost every day or second day, sometimes twice a day, just because I've been trying to, you know, mix up my, my food here so that way I don't eat too super unhealthy. I'm trying to be a little bit healthier. So I tried Panera. Uh, earlier, um, which wasn't bad. It was a little bit boring, like I had said, a little bit bland. Um, but yeah, that's why I came to the Original Hero, because it's relatively healthy, not like super healthy, depending on what you order. I'm um, probably not going to order just a Greek salad tonight. Maybe I'll get like a Hero sandwich, or hopefully they have a chicken sandwich. Um, that's the one thing that I haven't really had yet from this place, but we'll see. Honestly, guys, um, I am still in Pittsburgh until Tuesday. Uh, Brent and I will be heading to Philadelphia and possibly Gettysburg as well. I'm actually trying to sort out the plans right now uh, to see what it is that we're going to be doing next week. It's going to be one heck of a busy week. Um, I got lots of locations out that way, so that's not something to worry about. Lots of really, really good... Uh, lots of really good abandoned spots and really super spooky and haunted locations. It, honest to God, feels like I've been here for like three months. Um, like I'm really starting to get used to it. Yeah, I'm just glad that I don't have to deal with Canadian lockdowns anymore, which is uh, awesome. We definitely have a lot more freedom here in the United States uh, in comparison to Canada, which is more or less why I left. Um, obviously, it was just a little bit challenging to be able to find things to film when you can't really travel. You can't cross uh, provincial borders, which is just crap. But is what it is, whatever, uh, we're here now. And uh, we're definitely gonna still be here for probably like another two and a half months. I don't know, we'll, we'll see what happens. I don't have uh, exact plans as of yet, um, but I'm having fun, I'm having a really good time. Um, but yeah, it feels literally like forever. There's a train passing, but yeah, it literally feels honest to God like I've been here for forever, which I think it's only been, let's see, today is the, 16th I came in on the third it's only been 13 days not even two weeks yet and it literally feels so long which is fine I'm cool with that all right let's go in and uh, get some food